What's up guys and welcome to the channel Flame Wolf 4. In this video we're going to be unboxing the Dragpult uh, 25th anniversary Pokemon card collection. So this has probably been deemed as the one where you get the worst amount of packs in it because I think you get two which is why we are going to add a couple of the celebration tins that we managed to pick up. This is from Asda, so we got these from Asda. Uh, pretty cool uh, little tins here. We do need to collect the rest of them. But so far, we're going because this box is so small, we're going to go ahead and fit in the other ones as well. So uh, I'm going to open this up and just see. This got damage as well, so we're not going to put it in our sealed collection. But I want to see what it comes with. I want to see why it's such a bad box why people don't like it this was like 14.99 to buy this it's not a lot of money but as i say you don't get a lot of stuff in this so you do get the the 25th coin you get the drag power exclusive so you will need to get this collection if you want to make sure you're collecting them all and i think you just get one vivid voltage pack so you don't get a lot you do get the giant drag pole card which is just there it's pretty nice and that's the back of it, so it's not too bad. So you do get that, and then you also get this little wallet thing. Let's have a look at this first. So this is just kind of just telling you Pokemon Prime. And then you get this Train On Wallet card pack, which is actually not too bad, actually. Considering you pay $14.99, you get this as well. And it's got this, and it houses quite a few cards i do like this this isn't this isn't actually that bad this is all right so you get that with it as well so yeah the drag pole even though you don't get a lot of cards in there you do get a lot of other accessories um but you know most of the people that are collecting will be collecting it for the cards so i guess this is probably why and i mean if it fit them that big card in that probably would have been quite good as well but it doesn't so i'm not sure how this lifts out I'm just going to have to try and figure out. Okay, it just pulls down like that. So two packs of cards. I'm not expecting to get anything good from this. Um, the, the token just pops out. And I'm hoping that this card comes out quite easily. I can't really see how you get that out of there. Unless that's part of it. Yeah, that's part of it. So that's cool. I don't want to damage the card getting out. There we go. So this is the card it comes with. And you will get the code card as well, so don't worry. So that's the drag pulp card. And there is the code just for you guys. And another one that we need to add to the collection is our little drag pulp. So there you go. This isn't going to take long to do, which is why we are including a couple of the celebrations tins as well. So, so we can have a look in there. So let's open this one up. So the first one that we're coming across is a Lugia. We have ho which is actually a pretty decent card, not too bad. A Groudon, and Selegio, so Galio, so Galio. And then there's the code card for you too. So as I said, probably wouldn't get a lot out of that. I'd say ho was probably the best card out of that lot, but there you go. And then we have another one to do. As I said, there's not many to do in this one, but we will check to see what we got. We will try and find a sealed one of these at some point as well. Which will be pretty cool. Starting off with Dialga. Kyoga. Yvatol. And Professor Research. So it's still not too bad. Professor Research is the best one out of that. And then we have the code card there as well. So put that one on top. We always put the best one on top. Let's pop them over there. We have a Vivid Voltage to open up. So just get one Vivid Voltage to open and we'll just see. Again, I don't collect these ones. So I wouldn't even know whether we pulled anything good out of here. I guess a Nessa might be a decent card. Metacross Energy, Loudred, Subra Striker, Coating Energy. And then again, the code card just for you guys right there. But we're, we're collecting the 25th anniversary. We're concentrating on those first. 
and we might go and collect these packs at some point we don't know so let's go and open up these this one's still got the little security thing on it from asda um the drag pot one i managed to pick up from uh, a site uh, on facebook which is pretty cool called magic madhouse and these tins were from were from asda so you cool, you get a coin in there as well so that's pretty nice that's a sparkly coin can you see the sparkle on that and you get the card you also get a few packs so you get two celebration packs and you get a darkness ablaze pack in there as well so that it's not too bad we will pick up a few more of these at some point but for now let's pop that over there we'll open up the next one but we'll do this one first it's a little bit easier so you get the shiny coin inside just like that get the card two two packs and a darkness ablaze again so yeah not too bad so pretty good pretty decent so let's put them back in there and then what we'll do is we'll put those ones to the side because i was out the other packet with that and then we'll get straight into these ones so you only get two packets in the tins uh the tins are 10 pounds a tin which is pretty good unless you get them on offer we've got yevitao lugia groudon that's a decent card so that's really good. And Samazenta. So that's really good as well. So there were two cards I didn't have uh, back when I was trying to get them. But they are, these are two decent ones uh, out of that. So yeah. So I'll have to leave that on top. And then we'll give you your code card in a second, guys. So there, that was a decent pull out of that tin. So there you go. And that is the code for you. And right, we've got another one. Let's crack straight into it. We have Yvatel, Palkia, Lugia, and Lunala. So not great. That wasn't the best. Uh, I'd say out of all of those, I wouldn't even put one on top. I'm going to give you the code card real quick, which is just there. That's for you. We will open the Darkness Ablaze just to see if there's anything good in there. I know there is a Charizard card that you can get in these kits, which is pretty rare. We'll just run through just to see if there's anything good in there. Uh, Darkrai, I'd guess that's probably one of the decent cards in it. That Darkrai looks very nice. And there you go. We'll pop that on top of there. We're not collecting them. We're not dissing them. We're just not collecting them at the moment. So that's why they're staying out of the way. This is the second pack from the Celebrations tin. And we're starting off with Dialga. We have Cosmoium, a Zekrom, decent card. Already got this one though. And Professor Research. So another two really decent pulls out of that also. And there is the code card for you guys. We've got another pack to get into. We're ripping into these. Kyoga. Focus. Groudon. Professor Imposter Professor Oak. That's a decent card right there. And so Galio. So yeah, that was actually a decent pack. If you just got that one pack, you got you would have got two really decent ones out of that. So that's really, really good. Guys, um, we have this Darkness of Blaze to open real quick. Let's quickly blitz through this Darkness of Blaze pack, see if there's anything good in there before we finish up on the video. And have a real quick look. We've got Nikit, Shelma, Lavatar, Grimer. And I'm guessing that is Darkrai is a special card again. We got that Darkrai again. Um, Dead in the Bad Keeper, and so on. I really hope you liked this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. There's your last card code. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Take care now. Bye-bye.